welcome back to my channel. My name is Anna and if you're new, stick around. I have um, uh, some awesome videos for you. And today, if you're pregnant and you're more than 38 weeks and you're ready to have that baby, I will give you some tips on how to do that naturally. So stick around. Okay guys, so far my, my first tip for you today is to be relaxed. The more relaxed you are, the more likely you will produce some uh, pictosin. Uh, pictosin is a, it's a hormone that you need in order to have that baby, to have that birth. So the more relaxed you are, the more uh, pictosin you uh, produce and you don't want adrenaline right now. So you just take everything like very calm, calmly. Um, you need to like a draw bath, get some um, a diffuser with some lavender oil. Um, just uh, watch movies or do something but very slowly and relaxed. The more relaxed you are, the more likely you will have the baby sooner. So first, be relaxed. The next uh, tip that I will give you is to walk. Do some exercises. Um, you don't have to do like very, you don't have to like do a lot of exercise, but you will have to do like every single day some like a small exercise like walking very slowly for half an hour 20 minutes whatever you want um, don't exceed yourself but you have to do it like almost every day if you want that baby to be born and this will actually help you after after the baby is born to um, get back to your original self so i recommend walking every single day until the baby is here um, I remember when I had my babies, I walked um, until the last day, um, the day before they were born. So this is something I recommend and I actually did it and it helps a lot to do it just to like get back on tra uh, track after the baby is here. Okay, besides walking, I do recommend doing some, um, some exercises I'm going to show you here, that those exercises, and you can just do like 20 a day. And this will also help you like open the pelvis and have the baby sooner. Okay, so number three will be um, eat some peppers, spicy food, curry. Um, if you don't like that spicy food um, and you don't like uh, hot stuff like uh, chili peppers or something like that, like jalapenos and habaneros, um, there's some other things that you can um, eat that will help you induce this baby. Um, that's uh, the pineapple will help, um, basil, oregano, um, the black licorice uh, actually helps, um, uh, balsamic vinegar will help, and um, the eggplant. Eggplant, you can do it like there's a lot of uh, very uh, jammy recipes that you can do with eggplant. And those items will help you induce this baby um, in a natural way. So um, eat those things, uh, but obviously I do recommend eating spice um, like chili. Um, I like, you know, I like a lot of uh, spice. I don't need anything without salsa or jalapenos or um, some type of uh, hot pepper. But um, if you don't like it, do the second best option, which are the other things that I said. Okay, so that's number three. Okay, so for my, my next tip for you is have sex. I know it's uncomfortable. I know you're like ready to pop and you feel you don't feel sexy or but this will actually help a lot. I know the sperm has something that will help um, uh, break the membranes. So um, it will help you to um, induce that labor uh, to maybe um, to have it sooner so um, do it obviously in a very comfy way that you you don't harm yourself but and then the other good part of this is like you want to do it before the baby is here because you know after the baby is here you will you won't have time like for a long time um, for a lot, many days so just remember this and just do do it before the baby is here and this will actually help you have the baby sooner Okay guys, um, I, forget, I didn't tell you this uh, when we started. Actually, this I recommend doing after the week 38. Some say um, that you can start doing this on week 35, but um, remember that each day the baby is in your, be in your belly, it's, the baby is growing and it's, he is much 
uh, safer in the belly than out here. So um, these are these tips are for you, for you if you have like. 38, 39, 40 weeks even, and that, that baby doesn't want to come out, so start doing this. But just remember that the baby is due after, before they say 38, now they're saying 39. So I, would, I wouldn't do this, all of this, before the week 38. Okay, so that was tip, my tip number four. Uh, for the tip number five will be um, acupressure. Acupressure is a type of like, it's like a acupuncture, it's like a massage, but it's like putting pressure on, um, on some part of your, uh, of your body that, and this will help you induce la uh, the labor. So the two points uh, for a pregnancy to induce labor are going to be in here, like in the middle of your, uh, your hand. So you just pressure, um, pressure like whatever you're watching TV or doing something, you just pressure this point and this will make you more relaxed. You will feel it. Um, as soon as you pressure here, you will feel it. So this will help you feel more, more relaxed and we're, are more likely to induce a baby. And the other point is going to be in the ankle. So um, like right here, just you need just pressure or massage and you can ask your par partner to do it. And this is a, a, a good way to both um, be in this and you will, be, you will be more relaxed. Okay, so that was tip number five, I believe. Um, the next tip and I, um, is going to be, and I think it's the last one, is going to be um, massage ovals. When you massage your nipples, you will um, start like compressing the, the uterus. And whenever the baby is born, you will see whenever you're start, you're start whenever he latches on, you will feel your um, uterus like compressing, and this will make make it this makes it uh, for you to get to your uh, original size as before. So obviously, before the baby is here, when you massage your um, nipples, will help like start contractions and. Um, and start a process of labor. Um, you don't have to do it a lot. Um, just like after you shower or something, just put some um, put some oil or uh, like a lotion and just massage a little, massage a little bit, and this will actually make a lot of um, uh, difference. So that's my my last thing. The other thing that I wanted to tell you is um, oh, okay. So there's a, a tea of the leaf of raspberries that will help us as well. Um, raspberry is well known to help women um, and their um, and their reproductive parts. So and, and this will help you always. So uh, whenever you're ready to have the baby, you can drink this tea, and this will help you um, induce it faster. Okay, that's it for today, guys. Thank you for watching. Uh, subscribe to my channel and like this uh, video. Um, stay tuned. I have more, um, more every single week. Um, parenthood, kids, baby, pregnancy, even fashion because I love fashion. So stay tuned and um, so let me know in the comments if these tips worked. Hopefully they did. Um, hang tight. You're almost there, and it's a very, very exciting time. So congratulations. And see you until next time. Bye-bye.